segment. Ladies, just some spring secrets here as we get ready to go into the summer and spring. I know this bottle says milk and magnesia, but it's actually magic in a bottle. For my ladies that are oily, you want to use this after you finish any of your cleaning and moisturizing regimens. What you'll want to do is just take a little bit of that milk and magnesia and apply it all over the face with a cotton ball. It will absorb any oil that you have. It will give you a fresh matte finish all day long. Um, secondly, for a fresh face, which is also in for spring of 2014, if you do not want to do uh, makeup during the day, you just want a fresh look or something during the day outside of your after five or heavy makeup routines, I recommend the setting powders. MAC has one by uh, called Prep and Prime. There's also these uh, three by Ruby Kisses. There is a yellow banana powder, a darker powder for medium tan skin, and then a dark is powder for those that are, tend to be a little darker. And all you do is simply take those you dip your brush in them and you apply in small circles all over the face. Gives you a finished look uh, with your finished powders. Uh, they're called prepping powders or setting powders. And you'll use them either after you finish your makeup routine or after you moisturize and you do your milk and magnesia regimen. And you just want a final look, a, a polished look, you'll uh, finish with your setting powders. Uh, secondly, ladies, after we come out of the winter, we tend to be a little bit dry. But sugar and honey eliminate that problem for us. You just want to take a little sugar packet and mix it with a bit of honey and then you want to apply it to the lips. It removes all the dead skin and just gives your lips a push of moisture right before you go into your lipstick regimen. So I wanted to talk about lips this year. Lips pop. As you can see, I'm wearing a bright red lip, bright orange is in. What you want to do, ladies, to keep that lip stained all day long. After you exfoliate, you want to prime your lips with either a concealer or whatever foundation that you're using. Here I have MAC NC42 and I've applied it all over my lips. Then you want to go in with a liner that's similar to the color of your lip stain. Here I have MAC Cherry and then I use Ruby Woo, which is a bright red lip stain and it will make that stain last on the lips all day long. I also have what's called MAC Prep and Prime, which is a prep for the lips that allows the lip stain to adhere uh, if you do not feel comfortable using the foundation or a um, powder on the lips for the stain to adhere. Um, going along the list, we have, for those bare leg ladies, we have various uh, BB creams and um, bronzers for the legs and for the face for fresh finishes. Um, we also have MAC Bronzing Powder for just that slight hint of glow. Uh, and then lastly, for those of us who want just to kind of do a out the shower, we have coconut oil. Just simply take it from your Sam's Club and put it in a small container and just rub it anywhere that you would use in place of baby oil or your regular moisturizer. This is our voices, our opinions, your spring beauty tips. Thank you.